Hello guys, it's Biosphere here, and I'm going to be doing another Dota 2 Lore episode, and this one is going to be on Alchemist. Um, as is usual with these videos, I will read out the lore first, and then I will talk about it. So here's the lore. The sacred science of chemistry was a dark brew family tradition, but no dark brew had ever shown the kind of creativity, ambition, and recklessness of young Razzle. However, when adulthood came calling, he pushed aside the family trade to try his hand at manufacturing gold through alchemy. In an act of audacity befitting his reputation, Razzle announced he would transmute an entire mountain into gold. Following two decades of research and spending and preparation, he failed spectacularly, quickly finding himself in prison for the widespread destruction his experiment brought. Yet Razzle was never one to take a setback lightly and sought escape to continue his research. When his new cellmate turned out to be a fierce ogre, he found just the opportunity he needed. After convincing the ogre not to eat him, Razzle set about carefully concocting a tincture for it to drink, made from the molds and mosses growing in the prison's stonework. In a week's time it seemed ready. When the ogre drank the potion, it flew into an unstoppable berserker rage destroying the cell bars and exploding through walls and guards alike. They soon found themselves lost somewhere in the forest, surrounding the city with a trail of wreckage in their wake, and no signs of pursuit. In the tonic's afterglow, the ogre seemed serene, happy, and even eager. Resolving to work together, the pair set off to collect the materials needed to attempt Razzle's alchemic transmutation once more. Okay, so that is the law. <clears throat> now, let's talk about it. So, basically, there was this family, and um, they were very into chemistry. I don't know if it was their job or just their hobby, who knows. But there was this family, and uh, their name, family surname, I suppose, was Dark Brew. So, um, I would assume that the family enjoyed Coca-Cola and Pepsi um, so that's why they were named Dark Brew. Yeah so they had the son and his name is was Razzle okay now I know in Dota 2 he's called Alchemist uh, which is, is understandable but his his name is, is Razzle like like Dazzle but Razzle Razzle Dazzle maybe they know each other yeah so he grew up and he was in this family that uh, loved chemistry and he decided that he was going to be an alchemist and he was going to start manufacturing gold through alchemy so unlike normal people oh by the way i think razzle is an absolute nutter and uh yeah he just lost the plot but uh he decided he wanted to manufacture gold now instead of being like a normal person and starting off with something small you know like maybe maybe a piece of copper or you know even a sheet of paper whatever he decided, no, he's not going to start with small items and turning them into gold. He's going to try to turn an entire mountain into gold. Like, why would you st start out with a mountain? Like, I don't know if he had a role model that said to him, like, reach for the stars and you'll end up on the roof. And he just like, really like went overboard about that whole saying, whatever the case may be. But he started with a freaking mountain. So, and then he spent 20 years, two decades, trying to turn this mountain into gold. Um, and then he ended up <coughs> causing huge destruction and I don't know what else, doesn't really go into details, but he got put in prison for it. And I think that, well, I would imagine that uh, he got put in prison because he's a bit crazy. Maybe, you know, maybe the destruction was really bad, who knows. Anyway, so now he's in prison and he obviously wants to escape, you know, no, no biggie there. It's understandable. Uh, but then he was in prison in a cell with, with an ogre, very vicious ogre wanted to eat him. I don't know if that's uh, cannibalism, maybe it's, I think, I think Raz is like a goblin sort of. So maybe that is, maybe it's not. I don't know if ogres and goblins are like similar in, I, I'm not too sure about that, but either way, this ogre wanted to eat him and he managed to convince the ogre not to and then became his friend I, I don't understand how that works i you know i haven't been to prison but then he decides he's going to start picking all the mold and moss off the bricks in his cell and make a potion out of 
the moss and the mold and give it to this ogre okay now i don't know about you but for me moss and mold and um, drinking like a brew of that it's kind of like a shot of lemongrass or something and i wouldn't imagine that to make you like get really angry but it made this ogre extremely angry and ferocious and he smashed the bars and everything in his way and there is they escaped the prison and they went to this forest and then he decided oh sorry the ogre after this huge rage gets into the forest and is all of a sudden serene happy and even eager i don't know what he's eager for like to break more shit or whatever the case is like it just i don't know it doesn't make a hell of a lot of sense but anyways he gets into this forest and now he decides that he wants to try and convert a mountain into gold again so he's an absolute nutter. Yeah, that is the law of Alchemist. I don't know how they got into a battle after that. Uh, maybe someone wanted the mountain and he... I don't know. Maybe he was fighting over the mountain. But how he got into a battle after that doesn't make sense to me. But anyways, that's the law of Alchemist. Hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you think. Uh, come back in a week's time. There'll be another video. And thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.